You're listening to Soap Dirt, the latest in television entertainment news. Hey there, Bold and Beautiful fans. It is Soap Dirt on YouTube, and we want to talk about whether or not Hope Logan might end up pregnant by Thomas, and if she does, if it would be karma that Liam has coming to him. I want to talk about this because we've got some very specific examples and reasons that we think her getting pregnant by Thomas is kind of a perfect sort of payback for Liam's years and years of bad behavior. And we're not just saying this lightly. We've got data to back it up. We've got information. We're going to dig into that in just a minute. But first, if you haven't already, please reach down, click that subscribe button so you don't miss any Bold and the Beautiful spoilers, casting news, promos, everything you want to know. So we're thinking that it would be very karmic if Hope Logan turned up pregnant by Thomas Forrester. This week, Liam has gone over to Italy to surprise her, and he is going to see Hope making a move on Thomas. She's going to grab his face and kiss him so that Liam is hit with all the information that he has been denying. Steffi told him Hope was into Thomas. He's like, no, that can't happen. Thomas even made a statement to him that even if Hope made a move on me, I would refuse it. And Liam just kind of blew up and it's like, that would never happen. But it's going to happen and it's going to happen right in front of Liam's face. So I'm curious, just first of all, if Thomas will do what he said and if he will step away from Hope and say, hang on, what's going on? You know, what's happening here? Or if he's just going to go, oh, wow, she wants to kiss me and he's going to kiss her back. I don't know. We'll have to see. Or maybe he'll start kissing her back and then kind of go, uh, let's tap the brakes. I mean, realistically, Bold and the Beautiful is probably not going to go so far as to have Thomas and Hope hit the sheets. It's rare that B&B goes into deep, high stakes drama like the other three soap operas do. I mean, there was Finn dead and then he wasn't dead. When they got rid of Quinn Fuller, she just kind of like faded out and just disappeared one day. They didn't have some dramatic exit. Ridge is still waffly and he still hasn't stood up and made a firm decision. And, you know, like when they made uh, Baby Kelly Liam's instead of Bill's, if it had been Bill's, that would have been a huge deal. They just tend to like build up, build up, build up, and then they kind of wuss out on the plots. So while a lot of people are hoping that Thomas and Hope do hit the sheets, either because they're shipping that couple or because they think Liam deserves to have a little bit of cheating done back at him, I am just still not convinced that the CBS soap opera is actually going to go there, but I'm cheering for it because there's just been this big buildup. And if they don't ice that cake for us, I think a lot of people are going to be really mad, me included. So now let's look back at the past about some of Liam's behaviors that makes me think, gosh, I would love to see Hope Pregnant by Thomas. Uh, back in 2020, when Steffi was recovering from giving birth to their daughter, Kelly Spencer, that was when Liam got went to Hope and got her pregnant. And he was being manipulated because I believe Liam is so just weak-minded that he is able to be easily gaslit. If you don't remember, that was back when Bill Spencer had the hots for Steffi. They had had that one night together and he was basically, she had to have a paternity test and that was one thing that had kind of made Liam walk out on her and then they reconciled. But Bill Spencer was setting things up to where he could be spotted talking to Steffi or he could be overheard saying certain things and he was giving, doing these things kind of in front of Wyatt where Wyatt would tell Liam so Liam had become convinced that Bill and Steffi were still involved. And so rather than talking to Steffi, you know, he ran and sexed up Hope in the design office and got her pregnant while he was still with Steffi and while Steffi was recovering from the birth of their baby daughter. That was 2020. It was awful behavior. And it was the same kind of situation that he engaged in then in 2021. He repeated the same behavior. This was when Liam slept with Steffi while she was with Finn because he saw Thomas kissing that hope mannequin, but he didn't stop to confront Thomas or to verify that hope was even in his apartment because it could have been somebody else. And then he ran over to Steffi and then they got drunk. And then I think they got drunk that time. At any rate, they ended up in bed together. She cheated on Finn with him. He cheated on Hope. And the only reason Liam ever came clean to Hope was because Steffi turned up pregnant. And then they had to do that whole 
paternity test between Finn and Liam, and Hope had to be there for the reading of the results, and it was also humiliating, and all again, because Liam assumes he doesn't use his brain, he doesn't use his mouth to voice words and communicate, he assumes, and then he acts, and he acts badly. So you may also remember that just before Hope found out that she was pregnant with Beth, Steffi also had asked Liam to quit working with Hope. That was when Liam was over working at Forster Creations doing know, some publicity, some stuff. But basically, it was a lot the same situation where Thomas is working with Hope and Liam's like, I don't want you working with him, full stop. In the same vein, Steffi asked Liam to stop working with Hope because he had been cheating with her and their relationship was on the rocks. And Liam refused to quit. He said he was going to keep going. I was going to finish her website as if there's not another person that can do a website. It was like the website for the charitable arm of hope for the future or something. But it was an exact kind of flip of this sort of thing. And Steffi's request to Liam was very reasonable because anybody could have finished Hope's website. Liam's request to Hope that she kicked Thomas off Hope for the Future is not reasonable because he's the designer that keeps that line afloat. But Liam never sees his own hypocrisy, you know? And after that, then, you know, Hope turned up pregnant and of course, Steffi found out he had cheated and it was just a mess. And Liam's behavior is, you know, hypocritical and his ego could not accept Steffi's truth about Hope being attracted to Thomas, but he is going to see the proof of that very soon. And what we're wondering is if Hope and Thomas won't just stop at that kiss and if Hope will finally admit to Thomas, I've been fantasizing about you. I want to know what it's like to be with you. And if she hopped between the sheets with Thomas and got pregnant and then she had to get a paternity test, I think that would be exactly what Liam deserves for years of bad behavior and putting both Hope and Steffi in a very similar situation. And if she is pregnant, and I hope it's Thomas's baby, and I hope they name it Karma Forrester. I want to hear what you think about this. If you haven't already, please reach down, click your subscribe button so you don't miss any of our Bold and the Beautiful spoilers, casting news, predictions, everything you want to know. Tell us what you think. Do you remember all these times that Liam was like waffling back and forth and lying and cheating and repeating behaviors that he is now chewing hope out about? I really think that I, I, I know that I would love to see Bold and the Beautiful put Hope and Thomas in the sack for her to get pregnant and then, you know, they name the kid Karma because it would totally be karma on Liam. However, I don't have a lot of faith that B&B is going to go as far as we want them to with this plot. Let us know what you think. Thank you for being a loyal listener. Follow us wherever you get your podcast because you don't want to miss the next episode. Soap Dirt is on all the major podcast platforms, including Apple Podcast, Spotify, iHeartRadio, and more. 